For the past two days, we've been showing you different sides of daycare. Tonight, we show you one more. It's much less expensive, but takes some parental involvement. But then again, isn't that what raising your kids is all about? Boys and girls, we're really glad to welcome you to Joy School today. Lindsay's if you've never heard of it, well, you're probably not alone. The concept of Joy School started in the late 70s. Academics is not the basis of this program. The basis is self-esteem and to feel good about themselves, about the people around them, the world around them. And uh, so it's enjoying childhood while they can, I guess. Here's how the program works. Moms take turns hosting the preschoolers in their own homes. One mom takes the kids for a week, and then it all rotates. You teach kids once every six to eight weeks. The program only takes a couple of hours of preparation each night. It's pretty simple, really. You just read the lesson material and learn the songs and get the art lesson re prepared. Or sometimes there's a nature walk, field trip, a food experience. So it's all written out for you in the program. He can talk. He can finally tell mom. Betty Nelson was the teacher when we dropped in, but the other moms feel the same way. Plus, the price is definitely right. It's about $6 a month for the program. They send you the lessons. They're all planned out. All you have to do is teach. We teach them the joy that life has a lot of joys to it. They have plenty of time to become academically involved in school to learn the three R's. Joy School may or may not be right for you. And for that matter, daycare centers might not be right for you either. But what's important is to find what is right for your child. It's, it's real important, though, that whatever center is chosen, whatever type of environment is picked, the parent needs to know that they can drop in on that uh, daycare provider any time of the day, uh, unannounced, to be able to see what's going on, just to make sure that that child is safe. So now we know how to pick daycare and the choices themselves. But those feelings of guilt always remain. Will my child be shortchanged if he or she is put in daycare? Research will tell us that the parent-child bond is not affected by daycare. Research will tell us that what's most important is that the provider of daycare is looked upon more as a surrogate mother or father, and that they are part of the family uh, environment and part of the development of that child. All right, if you are interested in looking into a Joy School program for yourselves or your neighbors, the address is on your screen. All right, the last three days we've, we've seen lots of great ideas for dinner. Yes, and lots of happy little kids, and yeah. that's what's most important. The kids are happy, and you know everything's all right. All right, good.